In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix any lagging issues with Marvel Rivals. So if you're experiencing some kind of lag or high FPS, then luckily there are a few things you can do to solve this. So I'm going to start by showing you some in-game optimizations, and then I'm going to show you some things you can do on your Windows computer to speed up your game. So once you're on Marvel Rivals, click on the settings icon in the top right hand side and select settings. Then click on the display tab at the top. And the first thing you want to do is make sure display mode is set to full screen. This is going to give you by far the best FPS. Then we're going to scroll down to anti-aliasing and super resolution type. Now if you have an Nvidia graphics card you want to make sure Nvidia is selected in this list. If you don't see Nvidia or you have a different graphics card then I'd recommend selecting AMD FSR. For super resolution mode we're just going to set this to quality. Super resolution sharpening you can leave this as the default number 80. For frame generation mode we're going to leave this set to off. For low latency mode if you have an Nvidia graphics card then then select NVIDIA from the list. If you don't have an NVIDIA graphics card, then just keep this turned off. Then come down to limit FPS and you want to make sure this is disabled. Show FPS and network stats. Now this is optional depending on if you want to see your ping and FPS in the game. VSync, you want to make sure this is turned off and disabled. And then we're going to scroll down to the graphic settings. Now first thing you need to do is just click on this optimize button and that's going to change these controls based on your computer specifications. Now for the best performance settings, I'd recommend setting setting global illumination to SSGI low quality. For the reflection quality, keep this set to screen space reflections. Then scroll down to post processing and we're going to reduce this to low. Shadow detail set to low. Texture detail, we're going to keep this at high. Effects detail, we're going to change this to low. And the foliage, we're also going to reduce to low. Once you finish, click apply in the bottom of the screen and select confirm. Now just changing these settings alone should improve your performance, but there's also some Windows optimizations we can do as well. So let's just close out of the game. And the first thing you need to do is head over to your start menu, search for settings and click on the settings window. From the left hand side, select apps and from here, click startup. Then what you want to do is just go through this list and disable as many of these applications as you can. Now, these are the applications that automatically start up every time you turn on your computer. And of course, this consumes valuable resources. So you can see for me, I actually have all of these applications turned off. And once we're finished, click on system from the left hand side, select display, scroll all the way down and click on graphics and then scroll down this list until you see Marvel Rivals. Then click on options and make sure you have high performance mode selected and hit save. If you can't see Marvel Rivals from this list then you can always add it by clicking browse and then just navigating over to the game file. We're then going to click on gaming from the left hand side, select game bar and you want to make sure the game bar is turned off and disabled. Then come back over to the previous menu, click on game mode and we're going to turn on game mode as this is going to apply some performance options optimizations. Now the last thing we're going to do is just update our graphic card drivers. You can do this by heading over to your start menu, searching for device manager and clicking on the device manager tab. From this window come down to display adapters and expand the drop down and then just locate your graphics card from the list. Now I have two installed on my computer but Nvidia is the one that I use for my gaming so we're going to right click on this and select update driver and then press search automatically for drivers. Now if you get this message saying the latest drivers are already installed on your device then what you'll probably need to do is manually install the latest drivers from the manufacturer's website. Now, if you have an NVIDIA graphics card like myself, then all you simply need to do is download the official NVIDIA app. And once you have the NVIDIA app, you can click on drivers from the left-hand side. Make sure you have a game ready driver selected, and then you can just press this download button here to install the latest drivers. Now, if you have a different graphics card, then you'll just need to search online for the latest graphic drivers for your manufacturer. And once you're finished, you'll need to restart your computer, and that should have fixed any lagging or high ping issues you may be experiencing. If you did find this video helpful, then let me know in the comments and I'll see you in the next one.